So right now I am testing the E-Propulsion Spirit 1.0 Plus on my 12 foot aluminum boat. I've got it as unloaded as it can be. I don't have my seats mounted in here and I've just got the basic safety equipment on here and minimal cameras. And uh, we're gonna see how fast this thing can take this little boat. Right now we're hitting 5.5 miles an hour. More like 5.2. I'm gonna turn around up here and we'll go the other direction. This e-propulsion motor is so quiet. It's such a pleasure to take it out on this little boat. So this way we're hitting about 4.8, 4.9. So the other direction we were hitting about 5.2. I think we should say maybe five miles an hour with the e-propulsion Spirit Plus 1.0 at maximum speed in my creek. Okay, so now we're out with the 12 volt Minn Kota Riptide 55. So I think this might be the most powerful 12 volt fisher jumping trolling motor that you can buy. And, you know, let's see what its speed is on this relatively unloaded 12 foot V-hull boat especially when we compare it to the other electric outboards. And of course with these, top speed is a big jump up from all the other speeds. All right, we are hitting Three point one is the top speed I'm seeing right now. And when I was going this direction in the e-propulsion, I was hitting five point two. Oh, well, we're hitting three point two. So two miles an hour faster with the e-propulsion. And that's all she's got. And let's turn around and go upwind. Upwind, we're hitting top speed is 3.0. So 3.1, and the e-propulsion was, what did we say that was, 5.0, and I was being, I was being conservative. It's probably 5.0, 5.1, so two miles an hour faster. And of course, with a motor that's a dedicated electric outboard, like the Newport and the e-propulsion Spirit, it's meant to run at higher speeds for a longer time than this is. Trolling motors are meant for trolling. They're not meant to run at speed five or 10 or whatever the highest speed is. They're not meant to run like that for hours on end. Uh, they'll wear the battery down pretty quickly, I think. And uh, they're just not designed for that. They're designed for low speed trolling. But for some people, some applications, some bodies of water, that's all you need. You don't need to go any faster than this, and I get that. Okay, so third, we are now testing the Newport NT300. Same creek, same loaded boat, same day, same weather. Let's wind this up. All right, right now I am getting 5.3, 5.4. It's barely touching 5.4. As you can tell, this is louder than the propulsion. I, I think you, it picks up on here. Now we'll test it going the other direction here in a moment. Yeah. 
<laughs> Riding over my own wake. And going this direction. We're about 5.1. So what were we hitting? 5.4 and 5.1. So let's say five be generous and say 5.3. So it's two tenths of a mile faster than the propulsion for me, I think. So it's only slightly faster than the propulsion. And considerably noisier, I think. So there's our three electric outboards with a speed test. So in last place we had the electric trolling motor, 55 pounds of thrust, Minn Kota Riptide, only doing 3.1 miles per hour. Second place was the propulsion, and just slightly ahead of that was the Newport. But with the Newport, it's, it's a bit louder, it's a bit noisier of a motor, and you're only talking about one to two tenths of miles per hour. And, you know, I don't know how much of a difference that really makes. <laughs> I've never been late because of a couple tenths of mile an hour. But if that means something to you, then obviously you see which one the winner is. And I believe Tiny Boat Nation did a comparison of even more electric outboards. So if you want more information about how a lot of these stack up, uh, there is a video in my electric outboards playlist uh, from Tiny Boat Nation that compares, I think, four, maybe five of these things together. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. You stay safe out the water. <laughs> Anyway, thank you so much for watching. You stay safe out there on the water and please feel free to leave a comment down below. And here's another video that YouTube has picked just for you. Go ahead and check that one out now. It's a good one.